Hi, this is Blaine Perler with Perler Electric, and I'm going to show you real quick how to wire your key directly to your stator. I get guys that ask me this all the time. I kind of show it in one video, but I want to show it a little bit better in this video. All right, we've got the 93 through 99 stator here, and we've got a 2000 to 2002 stator here. And as you can see, I mean, essentially they're the same as far as connectors. We've got our four pin connector here, goes to our uh, CDI box, and then uh, we've got our other connector here that goes to your wiring harness, and you've got, you know, your ground wire coming off. So, I mean, they're basically the same as far as connectors go. Now, I don't have an actual wiring harness plug. I've got to use a, an end of a stator here, but you'll get the gist of it. What you want to do is figure out which way your stator plug plugs into your wiring harness. You know, you grab it and you look at it. Okay, so when I connect it, it connects like this, and it, you know, that's, that's the way it goes. What you want to do is the two yellow wires, and both of these stators are the same as far as wire coloring on these. We've got two yellow wires here. The two yellow wires, what you're going to do is instead of just plugging this in like you normally would to your, to your wiring harness, like let's say it went this way here, take take the plug, take the stator plug, and let's say, you're, you know, your two yellow wires here, let's say they plugged into these two here. You, what you're going to do is just turn that stator plug 180 degrees like this and then plug it into those two wires for your wiring harness. So that will still supply the power to your lights and all that happy fun stuff. So what you'll have left on your stator, you'll have, like I say, you've got half of this plugged in and then you'll have these other two non-yellow wires for your stator, you've got your ground wire and then there are other wire here. Those are the two connectors there that you're going to run the two wires from your key down to these two. Uh, you might have to go out and buy you know, a female and a male connector. Uh, just go ahead and splice the wire together, plug those in, but run those directly from the back of your key straight down to the two non-yellow wires on your stator and that bypasses your entire wiring harness because the wiring harness is notorious for shorting out and going bad on these triple cats and even the twin cats so you just your key goes directly to your stator key works normal works fine it, it you know off is off on is on but like I say what that does for you is bypasses that entire wiring harness and we've done that on all our cats and I know lots of people have had to do it on theirs also because of internal shorting issues so like I say, it doesn't matter which stator you have. I'll even grab the other one here real quick, the 93 through 97. In uh, review, our two yellow wires here, if this is how they plugged into the wiring harness, it plugged in like this, and we've got our two yellow wires right here. If this is how it normally plugged in, just turn that plug 180 degrees and then plug it in so only those two plug into that portion of the wiring harness so it plugs in like this and then run those other two wires straight from your key right to your stator the two non-yellow wires here straight to your stator and your key will work fine you will bypass your entire wiring harness and that's one less thing you have to worry about as far as as far as shorting out and and uh, the sled running bad at times and you can't figure it out after you've already bypassed your throttle safety switch and kill switch and your stator checks good and your pulse recoil checks good and you know just every once in a while you're getting misses or it runs bad and you can't figure out why but it's electrical bypass that wiring harness I've done it a bunch of my friends have done it I've talked a bunch of people through it I just thought I'd throw a throw a video together real quick just to give you a general idea how to do it with a little bit better visual aid here. This has been Blaine Pertler with Pertler Electric. Thank you.